President Bongbong Marcos updates us about his New York trip instead of typhoon carting this update from the President Marcos Twitter account as NDRRMC says 8,391 people have been preemptively evacuated in Metro Manila, Ilocos Region, Cagayan Valley, Central Luzon, Calabarzon, and Bicol Region due to Typhoon Carding. So, shinare ni Bongbong Marcos yung vlog niya sa New York, New York, matagumpay ang ating biyahe sa New York. Yesterday, he did an aerial inspection. He questions climate change. Pero noong 77th United Nations General Assembly, Marcos listed four challenges to survival of global community. At the top was climate change. In his speech, Marcos said climate change is the greatest threat affecting various nations and that its effects are uneven and reflect historical injustice. The effects of climate change are uneven and reflect an historical injustice. Parang he changed his tune saying this about Carding. Is that the trend? Yan na yung climate change? Wala naman tayong ganyan noon. Matagal na tayo nagbabantay ng bagyo. It's not that, hindi ganyan. For someone who claims disaster risk and reduction and environment as their main agenda, saying, is that a trend? Yan na yung climate change? Shows that he actually doesn't know anything. Meron lang siguro speechwriter na magaling. Ganyan talaga kapag gusto lang i-capitalize yung wind turbines sa Ilocos pero di naman pala intindi ang totoong issue. So VP Lenny was right after all. Marcos Jr. doesn't show up in the most difficult times. Ayun, nag-tweet lang ng New York, New York. Marcos Jr. needs to be consistent with what he says in his speech and what he says to the press. Hindi sila magkatugma. Climate change, you have to be consistent on climate change. change.